what is going on, everybody? Lunk is down about 50% from the last consolidation range. It's not really uh, lighting it on fire, if you will. Uh, we've had a, a big dump in the market. The market starts to recover just a little bit. Are we recovering yet? Well, not yet. Will we recover? I think so. And I'm going to show you exactly why I think that the run that we're going to go on is going to be parabolic when it does happen, and it will happen. One of the most important things about conviction is if you have conviction in something, then you hold on to it. If you lose that conviction, then you have to relearn it or move on. If this is not the investment for you, that's okay. There are plenty of cryptos out there. There are hundreds of thousands of cryptocurrencies that you can invest in, but the most important one with the biggest and most parabolic move, in my opinion, will end up being Luna Classic. Now, it is complicated and it is difficult. Terraform Labs, gone. Luna, gone. Luna Classic, well, Luna's not gone, but it's no longer, it's a, it, now it's a drift without an ore, if you will. So Luna Classic has an ore. It doesn't have a, a centralized process, but it has uh, people who've been working on it who care. And we will probably draw people from Luna Classic into the Luna ecosystem as we continue to build out here. And building is happening. Now, there's some catalysts that will kick off a, a bull run that's gonna be like nothing that we've ever seen. And I'm gonna show you the number one thing. And then when I do that, if you're not thinking clearly, you're gonna be like, eh, I don't know. And you're gonna be one of those dum-dums that goes into my chat after I post one of these videos and says something like, no, this is a scam. Uh, and, and then you turn around to your friend and you're like, oh, look at here, me make word. Me make word on, on screen and go, and go, we know in scam. <laughs> I just assume that you talk like that because uh, why else? So we're going to look at the number one reason why I think this thing is going to explode. You can agree or disagree with me, but that's okay. You're the dum-dum. I'm not. So let's kick it off. By the way, if you like this content, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, bell to be notified of future content. And don't forget... To cha ching baby, head over to Terra Casino and do some risk-based gaming. You can use your Lunk, your Luna for now. Bitcoin, Ethereum, BNB, BUSD, Polygon, Matic, USDC, USDT, and Dogecoin to have yourself some game-based experience here. Uh, there are uh, slot machines. There's uh, live PvP poker, uh, sports wagering. There is plenty for you to do over here. You just got to connect your wallet and go do it. You can connect with MetaMask, you can connect with Trust, you can connect with Station Wallet. There's plenty of different ways for you to connect with this thing. So uh, go check it out today. Now, as I was saying, let's talk about why it's going to move. The most important factor right now is this right here. China might reverse crypto ban within three months, predicts an expert. Are they going to be right? I don't know if they're going to be right. Uh, Daily Coin, one week ago, will China lift crypto ban if Trump wins? Uh, 99 Bitcoin says China is poised to reopen China crypto industry. Here's the secret bull run catalyst no one is talking about. China urges the EU to reverse EV tariffs. Uh, inevitable. Tether co-founder says China is going to open up to crypto. This is about a month ago. And when you start to look at some of these, uh, see, see some of these things, China reverses course on NFTs with platform launch. Um, there's a lot of uh, pieces. Uh, Bybit welcomes Chinese users. So something big is going to happen in China at some point. Now, will it will it be a broad sort of opening? Most probably not. They'll, they'll probably only use their own exchanges. So we won't be looking at just a broad level of insanity. However, if you have access to MetaMask, and the federal government there is no longer cracking down, if you will. Not that they're cracking down heavy to begin with, but uh, there's this thing where if they're not cracking down as uh, robustly, in fact, some people there, by the way, they don't even know the crypto's banned because it's not a big thing that people are talking about. However, 
when it opens up and the government says, yes, you can trade crypto, again, probably just Binance, probably just a couple of exchanges, then this opens the door for three times the number of people. There are 333 million people in the United States right now. There's 1.4 billion Chinese uh, potential investors. When that market opens up, and it will open up, then it's going to go absolutely bonkers. And what do you think they're going to do? They're going to look at more Asian-themed cryptos like Conflux, like Luna Classic. They're going to look at these kind of uh, cryptos as their favors. Uh, Pepe, the, the new Pepe clone, it, stuff like that going to probably just absolutely rip. But Luna Classic is an active blockchain like Conflux, and it's a public blockchain at this point. And I mean, it stands to reason that there will be a massive move into Luna Classic. And if you're not thinking about it and you're not thinking about it that way, I don't think you're thinking clearly. Now, this is all my opinion. I don't know for sure, but I would definitely go check that out. And by the way, uh, when, you're, it, when you leave Terra Casino, if you're going to do any kind of trading and you want to trade some meme coins, make sure you check out terraport.finance because that's where you go in order to trade your meme coins. Look at number two today, uh, Rakoff. Uh, number three, uh, USTC and Terra pairing. Luna Classic and Tutankhamen is down 27%, which means that Tutankhamen, by the way, that usually means that Tutankhamen is actually pumping, uh, and so would be Roddy, because the pairing of Lunk to those is completely off right now. So um, looks like there might be a little pump in this market after all, uh, especially for some of these meme coins. If you're looking for them, uh, go look over here at Terraport.Finance. Do it today. Sign up there, start trading today, uh, and have yourself a great time. Make yourself a lot of money. And now back to it. So uh, nothing new in Commonwealth. It's a very dry sort of couple of days here. Uh, as far as the price chart goes, it, you can see right here, we're at 71.42, up about 5% on the day. USTC up 6% on the day. This is not the breakout that we're looking for. This is not where we're going to end up. And I'll just kind of point out here that this is your volume node right here. You can see that this uh, this this is RS uh, uh, VRVP. This is a volume profile that gives you an idea of where most of the trading is done. You can see right here, most of the trading is done in this range, which is just happens to be where we're at right now. So that would mean that we're comfortable in that range. We're going to probably kick up here into this range right here, which is right there, that 82 level. And then the most traded range in this is right here. So it stands to reason that most probably we're going to have this move up here. Uh, we're going to get into this range again, and then we're going to come back up into this range because that's where everything is comfortable. And the reversal is almost here. Now, look, I can't tell you exactly when that reversal is going to come. I can just tell you that it makes sense that it's going to come and that we're going to have this kind of move. Uh, will that move continue? Will that move break out and go above? Will it look something like this and then break completely upside? I mean, it's possible. Um, I, I do think, again, by the end of the year, we're looking at, th at two zeros, one as my number we're not on that run yet that's you know that that's what's happening and you if you're weak handed or you you don't uh let's say that let's say that you suck at investing right so what do you do uh, you go buy a hundred dollar token called luna uh and they tell you don't ever put everything into something, but you don't listen to them because they don't know what they're talking about. You're the expert, right? And then you lost a whole bunch of stuff off of Luna. Now, I, I can, number one, sympathize with you, and then number two, point at you and go, <laughs> I can't believe you did that after somebody told you, don't do that, dummy, right? So I don't have any sympathy for somebody who doesn't listen. Never invest in one single thing. Never create uh, an inordinate amount of risk on your profile, no matter what. So if you did that and you got wrecked, I mean, I'm sorry, but you know, you did that. So does that mean that this is a scam? No, there are a lot of good people out here trying to rebuild this ecosystem. And I think that they're going to have a very successful time at it. And not only that, remember, there is a moment in time here where we are going to experience that just big, big, big move. Now, I'm on the daily chart right now. As you can see, we're getting towards the end of it. So there's going to have to be an epic sort of move for it to happen. But listen, there are epic moves that are going to happen. When I look over here at trade volume, it is down. Uh, when I look at market cap, it is down. Uh, but it won't stay that way. 
when I look at USTC, same thing. It, you know, it's not going to stay where it is right now. There are catalysts that are coming that will do something. And you might be saying to yourself, what, what catalyst? Like, I haven't seen anything in a while. Well, yeah, because it takes time. Uh, and, and yes, you did see catalysts. You just didn't see them work. Uh, you, you, saw, uh, you, you saw bridging. You saw Luna Classic coming back to life. You see a, a, a real meme coin universe now at Terraport.finance. You're seeing all of the little pieces starting to come back together. And you're about to see an anchor protocol show up. We just had an interview. So if you're not paying attention, you're not thinking clearly about it, then you're going to be like, oh, something bad's going to happen. But you're not thinking clearly. So, uh, and that's okay, by the way. That's okay. Your delusion is your delusion. You can be deluded if you want to. You're just not going to make it. Now, Again, it's very simple. If this is your conviction, be convicted about it. Stick with it. Understand that, you know, the, the smartest of the smart investors, they pick about five or six conviction plays. If this is one of your conviction plays, then you put your money in it and then you forget about it. Now, if the price goes up, good. If the price goes, you make a decision on whether you want to take profit or something like that. Good. If the price goes down, decide whether or not, number one, this continues to be your conviction play, number one. And then number two, DCA, if you still are convinced that this is going to have a big and bold move. That's very simple. It's very, very simple. So if it is, then we'll see at the top. If it's not, then, you know, exit. It's okay. Now, there's no governance proposals up, right? Because there's really nothing to talk about at this point. There, there, there's now, right now is the time for getting stuff done. There's 2 billion tokens that have been burned, 2.185 billion over the last bunch of days. Uh, over here on Coin Hall, if you guys can check it out. Uh, I remember I told you I did move everything into Rack Off the other day. I do, I do still have NMeme and then Lunk Pepe. But generally speaking, I moved kind of everything over there. And today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bridge Luna over to Luna Classic. And I think I'm just going to sell all my Luna. And then I'm just going to buy more Luna Classic. Uh, and then I'm going to use what I buy there in order to get into some more meme coins. So uh, that's that's my strategy. So um, be be you know I'll I'll be looking to update you guys on that at some point very very soon. Now it's so simple. You just have to not fumble the bag. If this is your conviction play, don't listen to everybody around you. Listen to you. If you believe in this pro project, you believe in this process, then you're golden, pony boy. If you don't, then you know move on. It's okay. However, there's a trillion tokens locked. There's uh, an anchor protocol coming. China's about to open up. Start listening. Start paying attention to the signs and the signals, and then you will get there if you're not already. Um, and, and if you're not convinced that something massive is going to happen, I, I mean, I can't convince you. All I can do is tell you what's happening and then let you do your own research and figure it out for yourself because there's a lot going on here. There's a lot to like about all of the stuff that you see. So what are you waiting for? Get to it. It's not financial advice, but I'm always right.